So I was about to go to bed tonight, but I happened to see just a, a news clip of Beyonce's childhood home burning down on Christmas Day. And so here go the Holy Spirit just started downloading the word regarding her. Um, so I'm up now. I'm going to release this word now. I didn't even want to, you know, do a video like this because it's a lot of things out there regarding celebrities and whatnot. And sometimes, you know, they'll accuse you of clout chasing. But look, I obey God and I release whatever he tells me to say. So this is not coming from me, but the spirit of the Lord is so amazing. And at times, you know, things can come off very far-fetched or just plain weird or just won't make sense to the logical minds. But Beyonce childhood home burning down on Christmas Day will be the start of chain of events, you know, for her life. And some things are about to be unveiled in her life and she will need prayers like never before. Like I felt an urgency, a major check in the spirit. Um, now, I know she's been tied to some controversy regarding her album, her songs or whatever regarding uh, witchcraft um, or her being tied to, to witchcraft and whatnot. But again, it's about souls and she will need prayer this coming year like never before. Um, but I do feel that she will seek godly counsel, you know, possibly in a private, you know, in private behind the scenes uh, meetings and whatnot. But God had put Beyonce and Jay-Z on my prayer list since 2017 because even though people don't see it now, but he has great plans, you know, for them, for their lives. Even if, uh, you know, they're doing, living the secular, you know, living the sinful life or whatever it is, uh, God always, he's, he's the man of change. So if he can change me, I know he can change millions and millions of others so um but he has great plans for their lives and if they choose you know the straight and narrow road to god then he's gonna definitely use them in a major way so be praying for uh beyonce and her family god bless bye-bye